so the first effects shot is subtle and hopefully it's something that no one noticed when they were casually watching the film. Uh, we have our actors Daniel and Suzanne and due to scheduling conflicts we had to shoot on two separate days. Uh, to make matters worse we didn't have the same lens or lighting kit and I forgot to tell my housemate about the tape. So he ripped the tripod markings off the ground. So Steven did as good of a job as he could matching the two shots in camera. We set the middle of the frame and let both actors know uh, where they should be so they didn't cross over into each other too much. And then we had both their heights, so uh, we gave them eye lines to match too. Uh, let's jump into the post now. I started by masking both Daniel and Suzanne and adding a feather and bringing them together. Uh, not looking too good right now. This was originally supposed to be the only thing I had to do, but due to the lighting and everything else, uh, I had to do some color correcting on Suzanne to start to match Daniel's shot a bit. I took Daniel's layer and warped it in 3D space uh, to better fit the rest of the scene. Uh, is the boom the shot? Yeah, yeah it is. So I took part of Suzanne's take and used it as a plate uh, to cover up the boom, and then uh, we're going to go ahead and color correct that once again to match the scene. Finally, I used an adjustment layer where we desaturate and decrease the contrast to help sell the effect. Add the letterbox to cover up the lazy job at the top, and we're done. It's uh, not just good, it's good enough. <laughs> 